Aurotitan. Aurotitan was a genus of Lamia saurine duck billed dinosaur from the middle or latest Maastrichtian age late Cretaceous, whose remains were found in the Udurchic and formation beds of Kunar, a moore region, far eastern Russia. The type, and only species is Aurotitan arharensis. It was one of the last non avian dinosaurs and it went extinct during the Cretaceous Paleogene extinction event. Discovery and naming The holotype specimen of Aurotitan consisting of a nearly complete skeleton, was discovered in field work in the Udurchik and formation of Kunar in the Amur region of Russia between 1999 and 2001. Pascal Godefroyd and colleagues described and named it as a new species in 2003. It was the first nearly complete dinosaur specimen to be described from Russia, and is the most complete Lamiasaurine skeleton discovered anywhere outside of Western North America. Large numbers of fragmentary dinosaur, turtle, and crocodilian specimens were found in the several hundred square meter area around the discovery site. Similarly aged localities in Blagovskinsk, also from the Udurchik and Formation and Xiaoyin, on the Chinese side of the Amur River, have yielded similarly high numbers of Lamia saurine fossils. The generic name Allura Titan means titanic swan due to its longer neck than other hadrosaurs, while the specific descriptor Arharensis refers to the location of the fossil find at Arhara County. Description Olorotitan arharensis is based on the most complete Lamia saurine skeleton found outside North America to date. It was a large hadrosaurid, comparable to other large Lamia saurines like Parasaurolophus sertacrostatus, and may have grown up to 8 meters, 26 feet, long and 3.1 tons, 3.4 short tons, according to Paul. In 2012 Thomas Holtz gave a higher estimation at 12 meters, 39.4 feet. It is characterized by the large hatchet-like hollow crest adorning its skull, very distinct from the crests of all of its North American relatives. The skull itself was supported by a rather elongated neck, having 18 vertebrae, exceeding the previous hadrosaurid maximum of 15. The sacrum, with 15 or 16 vertebrae, has at least three more vertebrae than other hadrosaurids. Further along the vertebral series, in the proximal third of the tail, there are articulations between the tips of the neural spines, making the caudal area particularly rigid. The regularity of these connections suggests that they are not due to a pathology, although more specimens are needed to be certain. Godefroyd and his co-authors found through a phylogenetic analysis that it was closest to Corythosaurus and Hypacrosaurus. Paleobiology As a hadrosaurid, Olorotitan would have been a bipedal-slash-quadrupedal herbivore, eating plants with a sophisticated skull that permitted a grinding motion analogous to chewing, and was furnished with hundreds of continually replaced teeth. Its tall, broad hollow crest, formed out of expanded skull bones containing the nasal passages, probably functioned in identification by sight and sound. Paleoecology O.R. Harensis shared its time and place with several other types of animal, including two other Lamiasaurines, the Parasaurolophus like Carinosaurus and more basal Amarasaurus. Additionally, remains from turtles, crocodilians, theropods, and nautosaurids were found at its discovery site, and the saurolophus like Hadrosaurine Kerberosaurus is also known from roughly contemporaneous rocks in the area. Unlike the situation in North America, where Lamiasaurines are virtually absent from late Maastrichtian rocks, Asian Lamiasaurines are diverse and common at the end of the Mesozoic, suggesting climatic or ecological differences, 